Hi kids! Welcome back again to another episode of Learning. For today's video, pag-aaralan natin kung paano na-derive ang equation of the circle in center radius form at kung paano isulat ang equation ng circle given the center and radius. So let's start with a circle drawn in a rectangular coordinate system wherein the center has coordinates HK and P be any point in the circle. So alam naman natin na ang distance ng center and any point in the circle corresponds to the radius. Ngayon, paano natin kukunin ang length ng radius? Gagamitin natin ang distance formula, kaya ko siya sinulat dito, wherein d is equal to square root of quantity x sub 1 minus x sub 2 square plus quantity y sub 1 minus y sub 2 square. So getting the radius of the circle, we have r is equal to square root of the distance of c and p, so we have x minus h quantity square plus quantity y minus k square. So yung x natin dito, ito yung x coordinate ng p and h is the x coordinate of c. Okay? Plus y is the y coordinate of p here and k is the y coordinate of the center. And then squaring both sides. Then we have r square is equal to quantity x minus h square plus quantity y minus k square. And this gives us the center radius form of the equation of the circle or we can rewrite this as quantity x minus h square plus quantity y minus k square is equal to r square. Okay, yung iba magtatanong, sir, pwede po bang mabaligtad? Pwede po ba siyang maging x minus or h minus x square plus quantity k minus y square is equal to r square. Pwede. Pwedeng maging ganito. Okay. Pero madalas na makikita ninyo sa mga aklat ay ang formula na ito. Quantity x minus h square plus y minus k square is equal to r square. Let's have the following examples. For the first set, isusulat natin ang equation of the circle given the center and radius. And for the second set, given the equation, kukunin naman natin ang center at radius. So, pagbabalik tarin naman natin silang dalawa. Okay, for number 1, the center is 0, 0 and the radius is 5. So, kapag ang center ay 0, 0 or that means the center is at the origin, ang ating equation lamang ay x square plus y square is equal to r square. So, given the center at 0, 0, we have x square plus y square is equal to r square. Ang r natin ay 5, is square mo siya, that is 25. Ito na agad yung sagot. Next, number 2, the center is at negative 1, negative 3, and radius is equal to 3. Okay, so pag isusulat natin siya into this form, we have x, yung negative 1, papalitan lang natin ng sign, so magiging plus 1, dahil minus h siya rito. So, square plus quantity y, yung negative 3, magiging plus 3 square. Kasi nga, y minus k siya rito, is equal to 3 square is equal to 9. Ito na yung sagot. Okay? Yung iba nakakalimutan na is square yung 3. Nilalagay lang dito, is equal to 3. Tandaan na ang r natin ay laging ini square. Next, number 3. C is at 0, negative 1 half radius is equal to 2 square root of 2. So, since ang x natin dito or ang h natin ay 0, then x squared lamang siya. Kasi nga, x minus 0 square, eh wala naman tayong value ng 0, kaya x squared na lang siya, plus y, dahil ito'y negative 1 half, magiging y plus 1 half, is equal to 2 square root of 2 square, i-square muna natin ito, so we have 2 square is equal to 4, and then square root of 2, tanggalin lang natin radical sign, times 2 is equal to 8. Okay, and this is the answer. Okay, so ngayon, balik na rin naman natin. Given the equation of the circle, alamin natin ang center at radius. So, quantity x minus 2 square plus y square equals 36. So, itong x minus 2, balik na rin lang natin yung minus 2, kaya ang center niya ay 2, and yung y naman ay walang kasama, kaya 0. Okay, and then the radius is square root of 36 which is equal to 6 units. Okay. Next, number 2. Quantity x plus 8 square plus quantity y minus 12 square is equal to 12. So, the center is at yung 
plus 8, gagawin lang natin negative 8. Yung negative 12, gagawin natin positive 12. So, the center is at negative 8, 12. The radius is square root of 12. Ang 12 ay may factor na perfect square. Kaya siya ay magiging square root of 4 times 3, which is equal to 2 square root of 3 units. Okay. Next, number 3. Quantity x plus 1 third square plus quantity y plus 6 square is equal to 16. The center is at yung plus 1 third, gagawin natin negative 1 third. Yung plus 6, gagawin natin negative 6. And the radius is square root of 16, which is equal to 4 units. Ayan. So, ganyan lang kadali. Mag- Uh, write ng equation of the circle given the center and radius at kunin ang center at radius given the equation of the circle in center radius form.